ஸ்டாண்டர்ட் ஜியோகிரஃபி யூனிட் சிக்ஸ் இண்டஸ்ட்ரீஸ் இந்த லெசனோட புக் பேக் ஆன்சர்ஸ் பார்ப்போம் டேக் பேஜ் நம்பர் ஹண்ட்ரட் அண்ட் தேர்ட்டி செவன் எவாலுவேஷன் ரோமல் லெட்டர் ஒன் சூஸ் த கரெக்ட் ஆன்சர் ஃபர்ஸ்ட் ஒன் சில்க் வீவிங் அண்ட் ஹவுஸ் ஹோல்டிங் இண்டஸ்ட்ரீஸ் கம் அண்டர் த கேட்டகரி ஆஃப் ஸ்மால் ஸ்கேல் இண்டஸ்ட்ரி ஆப்ஷன் ஏ ஆன்சர் ஸ்மால் ஸ்கேல் இண்டஸ்ட்ரி செகண்ட் ஒன் ஆன் த பேசிஸ் ஆஃப் ஓனர்ஷிப் த இண்டஸ்ட்ரி கேன் பி டிவைடட் இன்டு ஃபோர் டைப்ஸ் ஆப்ஷன் சி ஆன்சர் ஃபோர் டைப்ஸ் தேர்ட் ஒன் Kamul Dairy Industry is best example of dash sector. Option C answer cooperative sector. Fourth one, iron and steel and cement industries are the example of dash industries. Option B, mineral based. Fifth one, territory activity is divided into dash types. Option C answer two types. Then Roman letter to fill in the blanks. First one, banking is a dash economic activity. Territory economic activity. Second one, territory activity is divided into quaternary and quaternary. Third one, government decision making process comes under the dash category of territory economic activity, quaternary. Fourth one, raw material based perspective cotton textile industry is a dash industry in agro based industry. Fifth one, capital required for establishing a large scale industry is more than 1 crore. Uh, then option 3 match the following first one judicial sector a uh, quaternary activity second one tv telecast quaternary activity third one geographical factors raw materials fourth one capital non geographical factor fifth one bajaj auto private sector then uh, roman letter 4 distinguish between First one, secondary economic activity and territory economic activity. Take page number 133. The distinguished between uh, fourth Roman letter, la, first question or the answer. Secondary economic activity. Secondary economic activities are those that change raw materials into usable products through processing and manufacturing. First point. Second point. Bakeries that make flour into bread and factories that change metals and plastics into vehicles are example of secondary activities. Next one. Territory economic activity. Territory economic activities are those that provide essential services and support the industries to function. The first point. Second point, include the transportation. It, uh, it includes the transportation, finance, utilities, education, retail, housing, uh, then medical and other services. This is the fourth Roman letter. The first question is to use between the two. Second question, agro-based and marine-based industries. Take page number 135. Agro-based industries. These industries used plant and animal-based products as their raw material. Example, food processing, vegetable oil, cotton textile and dairy products. This is the fourth Roman letter. Second question, marine-based industries. These industries use products from the sea and ocean as raw material. Example, processed seafood, fish oil manufacturing units. This is the fourth Roman letter, second question or the answer. The distinct use of the agro-based industries or marine-based industries. Then third one, large-scale industries and small-scale industries. Take page number 136. Large-scale industries. The capital required for the establishment of an industry is more than 1 crore. Uh, then, the industry is called a large scale industry. Iron and steel, oil refineries, cement and uh, uh, textile industries are the best example for large scale industries. This is the 4th Roman letter. La. Uh, third question or the answer at the small scale industries. The capital required for the establishment of an industry is less than 1 crore. The industry is called a small scale industry. Silk weaving and household industries belong to this category. This is fourth Roman letter. La. Third question answer. A large scale industry or small scale industry or distinguished by Nildi Ganga. Then fifth Roman letter answer briefly. First one define industry. Take page number 132. 
industry is a process by which the raw material are changed into finished products is very good fifth roman letter first question answer second question what is meant by economic activity take page number 132 economic activity any action that involved in the production distribution consumption or service is an economic activity fifth roman letter second question would answer third one name the major economic activities page number 132 first point primary economic activities example raw cotton production second one secondary economic activities example spinning mill third one territory economic activities example trade transport up to this fifth roman letter the third question answer then fourth question what is culinary activity uh, elucidate with an example take page number 133 uh, culinary economic activity la culinary economic activities refer to high level decision making process by executives in industries business education and government next point la this sector include top executive or officials in the field of science and technology universities healthcare etc at the third point in our house our parents purchase household articles and make decision by themselves in some situation similarly the council of ministers take decision to introduce various people welfare scheme in this state these two are example of culinary activities the very fifth roman letter fourth question would answer fifth question name the factors responsible for the location of industries take page number 134 uh, raw materials, land, water, labor, capital, power, transport and market. This is the fifth Roman letter, fifth question answer. Sixth question, write a short note on the following. Option A, large scale industries, then small scale industries. Take page number 136. Large scale industries, the capital required for the establishment of the industry is more than 1 crore. The industry is called as large scale industry. Iron and steel, oil refinery, cement and textile industries are the best example for the large scale industries. Uh, next one, the small scale industries. The capital required for the establishment of an industry is less than 1 crore. The industry is called a small scale industry. Silk weaving and household industries belong to this category. This is the 5th Roman letter, 6th question or answer. Then sixth Roman letter answer in paragraph first one classify and explain the industries based on the source of raw material. Take page number 135. First detail industries are classified on various basis in the following ways on the basis of raw material. First one, first one agro based industries. These industries use plant and animal based products as their raw material example food processing vegetable oil cotton textile dairy products second point mineral based industries uh, these are the industries that use mineral ore as their raw material next point point marine based industries these industries use products from the sea and ocean as raw material Example, processed seafood, fish, oil, manufacturing units, etc. Next, fourth point, forest-based industries. These industries use forest products as their raw material. Example, pulp and paper. It's very good. Sixth Roman letter, first detail or answer. Second one, explain the geographical factors which affect the location of industries. Take page number 134. Geographical factors, first point raw material, bulky goods and weight losing material cannot be transported for long distance. Second power, power is based and essential to run the entire industry. First point, then next second point, these source must be located near the industries to fulfill its power requirement. Third point, labor. Availability of cheap and skilled labor is another important requirement for labor intensive industries. Example, tea industry. Fourth one, transport. 
it is needed for transporting raw materials to the industries and also for sending the finished products to the market next point availability of easy transportation always influenced the location of an industry fifth one storage and warehousing the finished goods should reach the market at the end of the process of manufacturing hence such finished product should be stored at suitable storage or warehouse till the goods are taken to the market then sixth point topography the site that is selected for the establishment of an industry must be flat seventh point climate climate eludikanga at the extreme climate condition is not suitable for the successful industrial growth idu varaikku eludikanga next vandu water resources availability of water is another important factor that influences the industrial location idu varaikku sixth roman letter la second detail answer third one classify the industries through a flow chart take page number 136 ஒன்றியல்ஸ்ட்ரிஸ்ட்ரிஸ்ட்ரிஸ்ட்ரிஸ்ட்ரிஸ்ட்ரிஸ்ட்ரிஸ்ட்ரிஸ்ட்ரி